I mean, like, you know, I, I ain't got no problem with nothing. Like, I, I think my life turned out cool, you know, because I, I, I came from a, a stable environment to start off with, kind of. You know, my parents was together, you know, and I tell people all the time, don't be so judgmental. Some of y'all women and me and y'all a little judgmental too much. Don't judge yourself. You know, I'm the product, proudly to say, of a one-night stand going the right way. <laughs> Technically, it wasn't a one night stand. It was like a one night that turned into 17 years of marriage and some kids. And I'm gonna say this: you know, it's a difference between how you have kids. People with money, you hear them talking all the time. We're trying for our child. We're trying to to have a, a new baby. We're working on a baby. Poor people don't work on babies. They get pregnant. <laughs> Any questions get asked. People with money, they got the shit figured out. Well, his name is going to be Lincoln. He's, uh, we're going to go into physics. Uh, his father was a hell of a chemist. Uh, we're definitely going to put some money aside so he can go to an Ivy League school. When broke people get people pregnant, it's questions like, I thought you was on the pill. You said you pulled out. What's your wife going to think? the difference, man, you know? My daddy took my mama home from Red Lobster, man. He had $20 in his pocket. $20. And he was unselfish with that $20. He got a salad for $2. My mama got a $17.99 Crab Daddy feast. You know what happened at the end of the night? She was feasting on them balls. <laughs> Cha-ching, winner. Popped me out, got pregnant. And I knew it was a got pregnant situation. Because, see, when I look back at the pictures of my sisters, I see all these baby pictures, baby showers. He got his hand around her, holding her. They happy and shit. I be looking back at pictures of my mama pregnant. They not even standing by each other. <laughs> my mama like this. My daddy in the corner smoking a cigarette. This nigga like this. This nigga drinking Hennessy. Nigga smoking a drum. <laughs> It's definitely a got pregnant situation for me. I mean, I love my daddy, you know. He, I love him to death. He got a good heart, but his credit fucked up. You know, credit gets fucked up. It happens. Some people just don't need to have it. Stop being gullible. You know, I used to tell him all the time, like, Pop, like, stop believing the shit you see in the news. Oh, man, I'm trying to tell you, they got a sale right now. They see everybody's finance. Everybody's good. He believed in that shit. He was the person that they make these pre-approval scams for. You get them credit cards in the mail that they got numbers on it, but it ain't got no Visa logo. But it got your name on it, you don't put that shit in your wallet, you don't call the number on the back thinking it has some money. Ain't no money on there.